you guys. Um, I was just looking at Cassie, and I saw a thumbnail of Cassie and Sean Puffy Combs, and um, they are in the news right now uh, because of the video that's been released showing what he did to her as she was trying to escape him and get on the uh, elevator. And I was just looking at how beautiful she is. And, you know, you look at her face and you think, why would anybody want to treat her like that? Why would somebody, you know, as women, sometimes we say, why, how could he do that to me? I thought he loved me or you look at other people and you think to yourself, how could he do that to her? You know? Um, and I was just reading a scripture today and it just hit me that if you see the spirit in a person and the spirit behind a person and you realize that this world is spiritual, you stop looking at the flesh and you stop asking how and why. If you see the spirits, the demonic spirits that are within a person, that are influencing that person, you stop asking why because you understand that the Bible says that we wrestle not against flesh and blood, right? But against angels and principalities and rulers of darkness um i don't want to misquote the scripture and also the bible says the thief cometh not but to kill steal and to destroy um and satan's job is to kill steal and destroy and when you understand the spirit in a person the spirit behind a person the spirit that the person is operating through and we understand that spirit came to kill, steal, and destroy, that spirit is wicked, it, it means you no good. You could be as beautiful as Cassie and just be treated like that video is disturbing to see. And, um, the context of what was happening in that video is even worse. And people look up to these celebrities because they got money and because they're on our TV screens and our movie screens. And it's like, you don't consider what's going on behind closed doors. You don't, you think because they're living a flashy life, red carpet, they're wearing all the finest celebrity apparel and they're dripping in diamonds and they're driving in the best and they're living in these big houses that that's the they're living a the life they're not these people are controlled by the people who own who have the actual who actually have the money they are controlled by them they are trotted out in front of us. They are permitted to come out in front of us. Look at all the videos of Cassie alongside P. Diddy on red carpet at red carpet events. And beautiful, smiling, wearing the best, forced to smile, forced to stand there beside him. And all along, this stuff has been happening. The video footage is old, y'all. It's just being released because... Apparently, according to sources, P. Diddy has pissed off the wrong person. He's been allowed to get away with this stuff because of the power behind him. And he's been allowed to get away with this stuff that he pissed off the wrong people. So now they won't come out on him. They just they expose him. So all along, you're seeing these people on our TV screens and the movies and videos and all this stuff and this kind of stuff in the video at the elevators happening behind the scenes and you have young women aspiring to be like that 
You have young women aspiring to get into that industry. You have young women looking at who's on stage, who they're rubbing elbows with, the deals that are being made, but you don't know the deals that are being made behind the scenes for your life to control you like a puppet. Yeah, it's not even really your money. It's their money that they're giving you through this contract that you actually have to fulfill X, Y, and Z in order to even have that money. They dangle it in front of you and they force you to do things for it. The spirit in the person, behind the person, operating through that person. If you see that, you won't ask yourself why. Because if you see that, you identify with that spirit because of Satan. You identify that those entities are dark, demonic spirits that are controlling people. The people are allowing themselves to be, to be yielded to those dark entities. And as beautiful as she is, she hooked up with the devil. Um... And it's really sad. But we wrestle not against flesh and blood. And that's what everything, no matter what it is. Um, so I just wanted to, to just mention that. See the spirit. Ask God for the gift of discerning of spirits. The ability to recognize and discern the spirit operating in a person in the moment the gift of discerning of spirits is different from discerning have this a spirit of discernment people say that they have a spirit of discernment well the sp saying that you have the spirit of discernment just means that you know the difference between what's right and you know what's right and wrong we all know the difference between what's right and wrong, right? We all have that built-in moral compass within us, whether you believe in God or not. You know the difference between what's right and wrong. So that means nothing to say that you have a discerning spirit. That's just to say you know what's right and you know what's wrong. But you want the gift of discerning of spirits. That means that you can look at a person and you can see the spirit that's operating in that person at that time in real time that's different and we all have been guilty of misjudging the situation misjudging whether good or, or of evil whether it's, we're judging based on appearances oh this person looks good they sound good they speak well or this person looks terribly you know, they, they look like a thug or whatever. And you're judging based off of appearances. That's not the gift of discerning of spirits. You're judging, you're, you're attributing good attributes to this person because of the way they look and how they, they're dressed. Or you're attributing negative attributes to this person because of how they look or dress. That's still not judging properly. That's not the gift of discerning of spirits. You're still misjudging. You need to judge based off of this spirit, the Holy Spirit, and ask that God gives you the gift of discerning of spirits, the gift of, okay? Anyway, I just, bottom line, want to say, um, no, identify the spirit and turn and go the opposite direction if it's the wrong spirit. Um, and it, it, I'm sorry, that video, that her, I just saw a thumbnail, and I saw the video the other day, but I just saw a thumbnail right now just of them two, and I'm just like, man, if she would have only known the spirit that was in that man, she would have not, I'm pretty sure she would have gone the other way. Hindsight is 2020. So, just sad. 